Come on. Come on. Uh huh. Don't hurt yourself. You always say I'm full of hot air. <laughs> What's up, Internet? Hey, Dinglebears. Now that you have watched my mother um, show her skills of blowing up a balloon, you think that's funny? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, today we're running errands. This is how crazy vlog life is. Uh, we're gonna go to Kroger um, and we have to put our masks on. Yes. Uh, Georgia is open. <laughs> Ray, we've already talked about that in a video, so I'm not gonna go into yeah, it. Yeah. But this is uh, this is the new normal. This is the reality of life. It's so hot. It is hot. Sorry, <laughs> I turned the car off with the air conditioning. My bad. Where are your hands going? <laughs> I mean, I'm not telling you not to. I just need to cut the camera off. But that's what's going down. Um, what? You, does your sister your sister watches all these? She does, and she asks if the kids can see them. Not this time. We have to get a couple of groceries. We're all out of veggies and stuff for dinner, and um, we're not doing fast food. If we do fast food, it's like once a week maybe and then Chick-fil-A Chick -fil but we still feel weird even when we do that because mm -hmm. of you know handling of product and we're not like super super scared of every aspect of what's going on but we're we are cautious and smart so uh we are gonna go inside of Kroger I don't know if I'm gonna vlog or not uh because I'm <laughs> we're gonna vlog with our masks in Kroger <laughs> oh man I tried to smell something the other day through my mask he Didn't you try him. to drink something through the mask? I was trying to smell something. Oh, you, you picked something up and you went to sniff, but you had the mask on. But you can kind of smell through the mask. And it also had like a cover over where I was trying to smell. And that's why you laughed. You mean the lid? <laughs> we got to go to the, the nursing home and drop off a couple of things. And um, we'll, we'll, we'll carry you along with the journey of this crazy day. Lavender hand sanitizer. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. We got the church ain't going nowhere. Kirk Everybody Franklin. With me. Oh yeah. We're going to Kroger. Going nowhere. You know who's the OG of wearing a mask? Michael Jackson. So when I go to the nursing home, I usually drop off a salty treat and a sweet treat for my grandma and granddad. So I'm on the chip aisle. I never know what to get because she never requests a specific thing. So. I heard someone singing on the other aisle, and that's Pamela. Pamela's on the other. So my granddad loves getting donuts, but the only donuts they have here is just glazed. I wanted to get him a multi-pack, but that's not even an option. <laughs> you look like you're stealing something. <laughs> I do. A lot of times I ask Pamela to lead the way because I don't know where things are in the store, but the reality is I just like looking at her bum. <laughs> That's the truth. Find that rosemary, baby. Oh, you got it. What a, what a great job you did. All right, one job done. I just returned the cart. Don't be the person that leaves the cart out in the parking lot, unless it's in the designated area, <laughs> you know. Okay, second stop. We're at the nursing home. And we got the Coke Zero and the treats. The thing is, like, uh, this is the scariest part for me is, like, you never know who's carrying whatever this thing is going around, and the older people and younger are the more susceptible to this, so we can't obviously go inside and say, hey, so I'm just going to drop this off at the front door. But, uh, <laughs> wish me luck. I love you. I love you, too. So that is done. Uh, the cool thing is the, uh, the place where I need to get the heart medication for the dogs is literally like, what, 50 yards that way? So, they have a pick up and drop off service so I don't have to interact with anyone. Sadly, I don't, I don't get to see any dogs or cats. Oh, I know, they're so cute. So don't, I don't want you guys to worry about the dogs. They're not like sick, but they take this heart medication a couple times a year, I think. And uh, it's time to get them. I went yesterday and I didn't have an appointment and I didn't have the prescription filled so I couldn't do anything because I didn't follow directions. It's all good. Okay, next stop, picking up the medication. So I just called my mom and said there are so many signs out here that say for curbside assistance please remain in your car. But then I was given directions to go around the side of the building 
because they have a basket for pickup. There's the basket. Okay. Ah, perfect. Well, that was easy. You gotta admit though, I mean, if you see like there's signs everywhere in this parking lot, just the time we live in. I've never been through anything like this. We're all obviously making the best of it. It's just odd, like that I'm not interacting with anyone to get stuff for pets. It's just, uh, it's weird. What's the weirdest thing you have experienced since this whole lockdown thing? I know every state is a little bit different uh, with the restrictions, but I am curious, what's the oddest thing that you've encountered since this whole thing started? Um, other than uh, the obvious of like wearing masks and maybe a plexiglass in front of a cashier. Like what's the weirdest thing that you've experienced or you've seen someone experience in your town? Put it in the comment section below. On with the rest of the day. Oh, Let's see if he does it again. Okay. <laughs> he was pushing me like, back up, bro, back up. Oh, look at you trying to be cute. He knows the camera's on. Such a handsome boy. So the majority of the errands are done. We had to put something in a mailbox for my mom. And uh, everything's been dropped off. We got the groceries that we needed and now we're back. It's supposed to storm here in Georgia. I feel like every time I turn on the camera for a vlog, I'm referring to like some potential crazy downpour. But that's, uh, that's Georgia in the springtime, which I guess is, is May considered spring? Cause I know May is in a couple of days. Is May spring? When does spring end? Spr is spring like March, April? Whatever. Hey. Fast forward a couple hours. I am preparing dinner with Mbamala. In this whole lockdown thing, I've been forced to, so I just elbowed you in the boot. I've been forced to learn how to cook more. Uh, my go-to is spaghetti and chili. That's about it. Don't let him play you. He is such a good cook. But I'm learning how to cook. I'm not, I'm just saying like I've had to broaden my horizons. Shout out to Sam the cooking guy. Oh, Sam the cooking guy. If you ever watched him on YouTube, do it. He's like blowing up. He's been blowing up for a while. Uh, but I'm gonna do mashed potatoes from scratch, uh, chicken and sauteed mushrooms and some salad. So I'm pretty excited about it. Delish. Yeah. Yep. I like that you put the lemon in the pan. That's very chef-like. <laughs> I saw it on Chopped. Mm -hmm. I'm chopped. I'm chopped. Oh wow. It is obviously raining right now, but this is the kind of rain I like because it's not dangerous rain. It's not extreme winds or anything like that. It's just kind of calming. I wanted to show you all of the solar lights that my mom has in the backyard. She's been working really hard uh, to make the backyard look cool. I mean, I can show you some, I just can't. What, oh, sorry. Are you mad? What's wrong? What's wrong? Every single one of those was put there by my mom. But because it's kind of storming a little bit, <laughs> look at all that. <laughs> it's crazy. Uh, she usually has that all around the railing of the deck. Oh, my hair's getting wet. Speaking of my hair, uh, I'm getting clippers tomorrow for my brother. And I'm going to try to cut my hair myself. I'm not gonna have Pamela do it. I know everyone's doing that in quarantine as they're having their partner do it. I just, if it if it gets messed up, I don't want anyone to carry the blame other than myself. So if I jack this up, it's on me. I'm probably gonna film it, obviously. Uh, so you will see the update. It is currently 9.46 p.m. We are winding down today. I just asked Pamela a very important question. I thought she was gonna say no, but she said yes. I said, uh, you wanna play some gin rummy? The card game that I played with my grandfather. 
she said. You caught me at a good time. Well, let's play. So, I'm preparing myself a beverage. Hello there. Matrachos. That felt very sexual. And I'm okay with it. Yeah. Hello, hello, it is now, what time is it? 11.04. The boy is sleeping. Do you have a dog that sleeps like that? That bed is completely big enough for him, but he insists on sleeping with his neck and head hanging off of the bed. Uh, we were playing gin rummy, uh, and now we're gonna call it a night. Pamela's gonna go feed the mother doe. If you know what I'm talking about, put it in the comment section below. I love that I put the camera on her and she doesn't feel the need to like spring into action and say something. What? Seriously? <laughs> Speaking of Shadow, before I close this out, I was just telling her as we were playing that, um, what if I just uploaded a video of Shadow sleeping for like, I don't know, 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. It's just a shot of him sleeping, maybe with some soothing music underneath. It's hard for you guys to sleep. Maybe you can fall asleep to that video. Watching Shadow, <laughs> Watching Shadow sleep. <laughs> I would love that video. I would watch it every night. I'd, if I post that, some people would love it, and then the majority would be like, what has your channel become? I just clicked on a one shot of your dog sleeping. And I would say my channel has... If you think this is boring, watch out. I might just drop a video of Shadow sleeping. <laughs> and nothing else she's throwing cards at me like i'm a stripper oh like uh i like gambit yeah like gambit oh mon ami oui, oui, oui. <laughs> all right guys i uh, hope you're having a great day night week talk to you soon uh be nice to yourselves be nice to people love you and au revoir <laughs> this could be this could be your future everybody Go to sleep, person watching. Go to sleep.